Shutterstock Music. Hi, welcome to this video. Today we're gonna show you how to do the uh, hip adduction machine. Now, hopefully you have seen our hip abduction machine, but in case you haven't, I do wanna um, let you know the differences between adduction and abduction. Real quick before we start. So, whenever you're talking about any sort of body part, um, when you do adduction that we're about to do with ADD, what that means is you're adding your limbs together. So in the case of the hip adduction machine we're taking the legs from a uh, separated position and we're bringing them together and we're squeezing together so that's hip adduction machine now the uh, the machine that I just did was the hip abduction machine a BD the difference with that is that you're separating the hips meaning that doing the hip abduction machine you're gonna be using your glutes um, and your butt uh, to be able to actually uh, separate in this one you're gonna be using the opposite muscles to bring them together and squeeze them together okay so once you sit down just because these do move around right to be able to to be able to um, sit down um, safely is to sit down first and then swing your legs over, okay? So, put your feet in the stirrups, right? Set your weight and then separate and pre-stretch the muscle until you feel slight discomfort. That way you're in the muscle and now you're actually picking up the weight, okay? So, once you're here um, and your, your weight is being picked up, your weight now you're actually ready to work, okay? Or not to put them down until you're actually done working out. Now that we're here, bring them all the way together and squeeze them together even though they're touching, okay? So bring them together and then squeeze, okay? So all the way out, don't touch, and then come back and squeeze together, okay? So let's do a couple of these reps. Very good. Now, remember to the entire thing. Make sure to breathe deeply. Um, that way your body still has access to that oxygen and your muscles need that oxygen to be able to keep working, okay? All the way together, squeeze together and release. Now, this machine should be the same as any other hip abdu uh, abduction machine that you use. Um, regardless of what model or what gym you actually work out at. Now, if you are working here at fitness, remember that you can go to the PT desk and schedule a first and second workout with a trainer so that you can have a personal one-on-one -on -one session with a trainer that can actually go through all of these machines with you so that you know what to do, okay? Now that we're done with that, to get up, that uh, once you stand up just like this, that way your hips are actually at a less angle as if you I was sitting down. Meaning that um, I can actually take the weight off my muscles. Now I can pull up the safety guard here to release. And that's it. So one leg over the other and that's all, okay? Now, if you have any questions, go ahead and call or text the uh, or go ahead and go to my website and contact me. But until then, I do hope to see you soon. Alrighty, bye.